Hi ladies, just wanted to share with you my latest mini album. Um, I finally finished this this morning. Um, this is a manila folder um, mini album. Um, I saw the tutorial on YouTube. Um, sorry, I can't remember where. It's saved in my favourite somewhere. Um, so I've tweaked this a little bit to modify to suit how I wanted it. Um, so I've just give you a quick run through of what I've used. Um, so on the front I've actually used two bits of chipboard for the cover. Um, I painted the chipboard with gesso before using the Tim Holtz crackle paint. Um, I used peel paint for the colour and the papers I've used through this are Kayser Craft Chapter 1 um, which I really like the colours of. Um, so on the front here I've just cut out a little ornate backing piece. Um, these flowers here, these roses here are from I Am Roses and this one here I actually made myself um, using white cardstock peel paint, distress ink and some glimmer mist. Um, these little hat pins I made myself. Um, I've used ZVA Creative Bling Flourish that I've just sort of cut and modified to suit. Um, this is a ornate plate from Tim Holtz that I've put on here and I've called the, the mini album Nine and Mine. Um, it actually contains um, my pregnancy photos um, and this little hitch clasp I've used um, I got this idea from a YouTube lady as well um, rather than using the Tim Holtz ones as I can't find them here not very many people stock them um, this is an eyelet I don't know if you can see that well enough an eyelet with a brad glued on the top in the top and then I've just put the hole through and just spread the little bit of eyelet at the bottom and spread that through to hold it on so and it's worked really well so I've just got a bit of a um, bit of hat elastic um, threaded so I've just tied a knot through there and I've got it hooked over for that um, the binding um, I've actually used um, the tutor followed the tutorial that I found and I'll try and figure out which one it was for that and just to reinforce it I've put a bit of black gaffer tape around it just to reinforce it so it was coming apart a bit the more I put in it. Um, so I'll just get started. Stand up. So this is the first page. So I've just used some black and white photos. Um, worked really well with the black and the white because this, the colours of the chapter one paper is white, teal, green, and black. Is the colours. Um, so I've just put in a few photos here, and then it's got a flip down. Here, and I've put in think of the world you carry within you um, and the most important things in the world have been accomplished by people who have kept trying when there seemed to be no hope at all um, which kind of represents um, the journey we went on um, we had a lot of trouble conceiving um, so it didn't happen overnight but eventually it did happen so then I've just got a little tag goes in a little pocket so got some more bling here more flowers there's my husband's hands on my belly this one flips up so I've got some journaling under here some more tags and journaling up in here 
And then this one I've got a little pocket. And some more journaling on the back. This one here flips down. Some more journaling. It's flowers. And these ones have matted, so I've used black and white and colour. Seem to work well. Some more flowers. And that's the back of the album. So it's not a, a huge mini, but um, it's quite a cute little one that I can take around and and show relatives um, and and hang on to. Um, so thanks for watching.